Hey, this is Eric Windheim, building biologist and electromagnetic radiation specialist. We're tracing down the various sources of dirty electricity here at a house in the coast range. Um, some of it's indoors from light bulbs and dimmer switches. Some of it's coming in from the utility and some of it's coming from the <clears throat> solar inverter that's on the solar here. So we're going to ask the person in the back room to turn on the high intensity discharge lights. Please turn them on. Okay, so we can see that the Stetzer meter went up from 130 to 1260 or about 10 times higher. And of course the waveform is just off the chart here. And we're seeing broad, a lot of uh, spectrum analysis here at 60 kilohertz and a lot here in the 10 to 20 kilohertz. Okay, you can turn them off now. Okay, so you can see just one set of bad lights can really uh, ruin your whole day. Like they used to say, one atom bomb can ruin your whole day. Okay, so I'm going to go outside now and um, turn off some of the problematic circuit breakers. Some of the circuit breakers are associated with dirty electricity. We're going to turn those off right now. Okay, it actually dropped down to 91. We turned off the two shop 60 amp breakers and you see now we're down to 91 instead of 160 or so or 130. So as we can see sometimes you have dirty electricity inside the house and sometimes it's outside the house. So I'm going to uh, turn off a few more things. Okay, currently everything in the house is off and this is what's coming in from the utility. Only the main service disconnect is open, I mean is connected. Every other breaker is off. So this is what we're getting coming in from next door up and down the street, whatever they happen to be doing. And we've seen this go up to four or five hundred. Mm -hmm. It depends upon what's going on next door. So this is what's coming in on your electric service. It doesn't do you any good. It doesn't run your motors. It doesn't run your light bulbs. And it's actually a very hazardous thing that at the very least will shorten the life of any printed circuit board or your own biology. Thank you very much for watching.